How's it going, guys? Um, we are back. We are back for, um, well, the version 4.5 live stream special program. So, I guess we'll see how that goes. I haven't watched it. It's my first time watching, um, this, uh, special program. So, we'll see how that goes. And uh, then we will move over to Genshin Impact, obviously. Hello, travelers. Welcome to the 4.5 special program. Hey, hey, sir. My name is Zach Aguilar, and I voice the male traveler. Yeah. Today, I'm hosting with... An old friend, right? Meowdy, everyone. Friend, eh? My name is Julia Gu. I'm the voice of Kirara. <laughs> and I'm Brittany Lotta, the voice actor for Chiori. I'm really excited to be on the hey. special program with you guys for the first time. <laughs> Hi everyone, my name is Valeria Rodriguez, and I'm the voice of Sucrose. Also very excited to be here. Let's, Let's give everyone a chibi everyone. applause! A chibi applause? <laughs> so cute. It's a chibi but applause. But seriously, this yep. is an incredible crew, you guys. Now I'm even more curious to know about the contents of version 4.5. <laughs> Why don't we find out by taking a look guys. at the version 4.5 trailer? Yes! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Let's go! Trailer? Go! Wow. I can't believe I'm getting the key to shaking up Mondstadt's entire wine industry in my oh. own two hands! I can oh. just see it now. The more alcohol those uh, drinks okay. consume, <laughs> the more sober they'll become! <laughs> I wonder if it could also be used to turn water into uh. wine? Alternatively, yeah. a strength-enhancing potion Ooh. could make it so that Pinewood could take down an Abyss Mage all her own. How are we supposed to make a potion <laughs> like really? that? Really? I don't know. Oh. walking on all that rough terrain. Hey, it was like it was never there. With this in my arsenal, I bet I could deliver 200 orders traveling. in a single day. That could go over to that. Excuse me. Coming through. Maybe she's Coming a monster. Through. Shuri, your, your shipment's here. Need a bit of the shipment's is here. No, just ran into a bit of trouble. <laughs> ah, it's a bit goofy this time around. Ooh. It's up to is me this... to decide who I want to be. I'm to cut my own path. Okay. No one Sorry. can tell me nice what to do. Let's go, Toto. Toto. Okay. Delicate as silk. Yes. Next customer, the Spina's on the case. Okay, I'll move in Navia. Fiori here, I'd like to return my outfit. What kind of rag are you trying to sell us, huh? Really? You didn't get bought out by Blades my competitors, did you? It's brocade. <laughs> the package. Welcome back, travelers. I'm sure that everyone's keen to hear more about the new version. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let's get on with it then. Let's get on um, with it. Surprisingly, our first bit of information relates to our newest character, Chiori. Whoa. Chiori, <laughs> huh? get away. It's just a piece of fabric? Oh, why was it in the box? Fabric. Whoa, it's actually really beautiful. Uh -huh. A professional designer like Chiori is very strict about her materials. About her materials she huh? probably uses unique fabrics pretty frequently. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Mm -hmm. I thought that Chiori left a really strong uh, impression at the yep, Fontanalia Film Festival. Did. Yeah, definitely. You can get a really good read on her based on how she dresses and the way that she talks. Uh -huh. Ooh, I agree. She seemed firm, firm and decisive. decisive. Like that the she kind is. of person who always says exactly what she means. Mm -hmm. I also get the impression that she's not afraid of going after what she wants. Yeah, uh -huh. it must have taken a lot of effort for an Inazuman to become so yep. successful in the really fashion industry. Yes. Really impressed. Uh, Harry's been I bet her success was of the town. a lot of skill and her... talent. The fact you know, that she was, was you all in, seem pretty familiar got, with Chiori already, but you might not be aware about her combat and and so let's take a moment to appreciate her fighting style. Let's Okay, let's see her fighting style. How she will. It's up to me to decide who I want to be, and to cut my oh. own path. No one I'd can tell me what to do. Okay. Combo. Let's go, Tomato. Oh, Tamotos. Ah, okay. I am the cutting edge of fashion. Oops. Oh my god, she's so <laughs> cool. Oh yeah. Like, um, have you seen her doll? It's so cute. You could say that she's a cut above the rest, uh, if you will. <laughs> cut above the yeah, rest. I love her animations. They're so sleek. Yes. Yeah, super stylish. Major style points. Mm -hmm. Major I love style her swords. Points. They're super, super cool. I want to add them to my own collection. 
Yeah. Did you see that Better during see. her burst, she actually crosses well. them over to look like scissors? <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, I didn't notice that. <laughs> Catch. Yeah. Observers Ouch. often consider Giori to be an okay. unconventional Altering. designer. Yeah. She has a yeah. unique way of designing her clothes. Aside from using her own blades to cut fabric, she also uses an automaton named Tamoto. Her longtime personal assistant is always ready to help produce and model her designs. Really? Tamoto is indispensable to how Chiori expresses her unique creative vision to the world. It's like she has an aura that proclaims to everyone, this is fashion. <laughs> 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 yeah, totally. Chiori's found an ingenious way to incorporate her design making assistance into combat. Too. That's a, During her elemental chill. skill, Ops Chiori Mojo summons to Tomoto to attack her opponents. She also performs an upward strike Chiori. and deals damage to her enemies based on her attack and defense stats. Mm. Wait, wait. Chiori made that automaton mm, herself? Wow, it's so intricate. Maybe she could expand into a new industry hey, if she wanted. <laughs> For sure. When her elemental skill is held, Chiori oh. can adjust the direction of her dash to attack enemies from multiple it, angles. And as like an experienced businesswoman, Chiori well. knows how to capitalize on favorable conditions. Chiori will summon an additional automaton when Tomoto well. is active, yep. and there are other geo constructs on the field. Huh. Okay. Other By unlocking one of her specific talents, Chiori can trigger special It'll effects make. when using her skill or normal attack during the upward strike on her elemental skill. Oh, interesting. So it seems like you can even switch your active character by using her skill. Uh-huh. Her little assistant seems to save her really? a lot of trouble. Oh, absolutely. Chiori doesn't like to waste her time on uh, wow. trivial matters. If someone tests her patience, then she'll end the battle with a strike as sharp and fierce as her personality. <laughs> Ooh. Uh. Chiori may be a professional designer, but she's also really fun to watch in combat. For sure. Yeah. Chiori doesn't think that fashion stops at appearances. It also needs to serve a functional purpose. Hmm. When Chiori is in your active party and any of your characters are wearing a unique outfit or a non-default wing glider, the whole team will have their movement speed increased. Hmm. That's well, you what have makes to... her a true designer. <laughs> you need a unique outfit in order and to increase your well, whole party movement speed. Oh? Hmm? Chiori tends to run into a lot of trouble. Okay. It oh, might be because of her blunt personality, but uh, unexpected problems often arise, no matter how much she tries to I mean, avoid it's them. Less mm, I'm bubbles, sure that a straightforward person like Chiori has her own they, um, methods of getting herself out of those situations quickly. <laughs> it's Who's possible. That? Chiori is an unconventional designer with a clear vision. She isn't afraid to go after what she wants, and yeah. that approach yeah. has made her very, made her very successful. Indeed. Chiori will do anything to make sure the Chioria brand becomes renowned throughout all of Tibet. Sure, brand. So she's always looking for ways huh? to increase its exposure, such as participating in Fontaine Fashion Week. Fontaine Fashion Ooh. Week. Yep. I bet she probably has to go fashion all week, out right. on Fashion Week. <laughs> Chiori's story quest, the Sisoria chapter. So this is going to be a new story quest. Travelers Zoria will be chapter. to accompany Chiori as she confronts unexpected okay, challenges so during Fontaine Fashion Week. Let's remember to do I'm that curious. when that drops. What kind of challenges are they? Shh, we'll have to wait and see. But I'm sure that Kirara will be there to help Chiori. Yeah, Ch so Chiara will, will be there. Oh, I can't wait to see what kind of interactions they'll have. <laughs> I should mention that Chiori also designed Kirara's outfit. Oh, so Kirara is one of Chiori's clients. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Yeah. If I mean, we know, you we know want that. to learn more about Chiori, <laughs> then be sure to check out her story quest when it becomes available. Actually, travelers won't just be spending time with Chiori. Lynette's hangout event what? will also be available really? in version 4.5. After travelers complete her quest, they'll receive a special reward. <laughs> the Fatometer. Ooh. Awesome. Oh, this is That's a pretty so interesting cool. tool. That's you so cool. You can draw cool. a random number from a hat when you interact with the Fatometer. So if travelers are ever stuck on a decision, they can use the Fatometer as an interesting solution. Audio me meter? Yeah, if you're farming for artifacts or enhancement materials uh, in co-op mode, okay. you might run into a situation mode? where multiple people want to use the same character. Mm. But you can decide a same winner character. by drawing a random number with the Fatometer. It seems pretty convenient, right? Mm, yeah, mm -hmm. for sure. Especially if you're as hey. easily overwhelmed and indecisive so. as I am. <laughs> if you have a lot of content it. to explore, then you can even use the fatometer to decide where you should start. It could save you from going back and forth. <laughs> yeah. How about we try the fatometer and see which number it gives us? Oh, me first. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. 
have we okay, decided okay. what the numbers mean? Fifteen. Oh, uh, how about this then? Whoever draws the largest number gets to introduce the next piece of information. Ooh. Okay. okay. So I think I'll be sitting this one out. I already got to introduce Chiori. <laughs> Fair enough. All right, I'll go. One. Ooh, that's rough. Yeah, 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 that's rough. Oh, my turn. <laughs> well. Oh. You were so close. You were so close. <laughs> well, it seems like Zack is the winner. Take it away, big man. Let's go. Uh. <clears throat> We'll have event wishes for okay, so Ito in have, uh, the first half event of wishes, so Aratachi Ito is back. Five -star sword, Raku Misugiri new weapon, will be featured on Raku the weapon event Misugiri. That weapon is so you. cool. It's aesthetically pleasing. Okay. <gasps> so it's not just a good weapon for Chiori. Ah. Might also work for Albedo. That's sword. something that travelers will have to try hills. out for themselves. Oh. Nervalette and Cosmo will also rerun oh, the second wait, wait, wait. version. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So Nervalette is coming back, which is coming back so quick? Really? Oh, and that's not all. Wait, wait, wait. It looks like we also have information about back. a new type of wish. The Chronicle. Hasn't been that. Wait. Uh, what's that? Yeah. Let what? me explain. A new He's type be of chosen banner will be available thing. starting from version 4.5. Yeah? The Chronicled, Chronicled wish. Wishes. The Chronicled Wish banner will allow travelers to obtain travelers a variety, obtain a variety of, characters, of characters such as Glee and, and the Looch. Oh. They'll also be able to obtain <laughs> weapons such as Hunter's Path and Wolf's Gravestone. <laughs> Hunter's Path and Wolf's Gravestone? Oh, wow. oh, that's cool. Oh, how do we do Wait, those? if so many characters and weapons are going to be on the same banner, won't it be kind of hard to pull for exactly yeah. who you want or yeah. what you want? Nope. You can chart a specific course for the character or weapon that you want. Plus, it only takes a maximum chart of a specific one fate course? point to guarantee your target. Oh, so it's You're like the weapon banner. an item that matches your target type. For example, if you're targeting a specific five-star character, whatever you end up pulling is guaranteed to be what? a character. Oh. The same is true um, for weapon pulls. That's yeah, yeah. Neat. That's, that's, Seems like that's a great so opportunity cool. For travelers to make up for Why out on certain characters didn't they do that they earlier? <laughs> There's one thing that I have to clarify. Oh. These new banners huh? will only feature five-star characters that have had at least three character event wishes and have not appeared on any recent banners. Mm. Okay. More details See. about the Chronicled Wish banners will be revealed in an official announcement. Be sure to keep an eye out if you're so interested in So it's going to also, change periodically? Also, version 4.5 will introduce a training guide system training to make it guide easier system. for new travelers to explore to vet. We'll provide training more details later system. on in the program. Okay. okay. We've just finished the event wish section of the program. Let's take a short break while we display the second so, um, redemption code. Awesome. The chronicled, the chronicled wish system. Also, that artwork, <laughs> magnificent. I don't know. So, we have the weapon banner system uh, with the fate points fate points that if you don't have the weapon that you desire in the first five star weapon that you pull and you're automatically going to get in the second um well five star you get at, at least if you get one obviously <laughs> but this is going to be the same thing but this time around it's going to be for characters as well and it's going to be periodically so we saw Klee so Albedo, uh, Jean, uh, Deluke. To the version 4.5 special I'm, I'm program. I'm not that. I'm not complaining Let's at all. Let's move on to the next bit of content. Hmm. Let me see here. Okay. Bottle. Huh. Bottle. Yeah. Hmm. But we see a potion. Judging from the shape of the glass <laughs> and the color of the liquid, I'm guessing that the bottle has something to do with alchemy. Alchemy. And okay. judging from our surroundings, maybe Mondstadt is also involved. Bingo. Huh. Next, we're we going back to Mondstadt. Takes place in Mondstadt. It's an alchemy event. Yay! As the city of Mondstadt continues to develop, its leaders are busy with planning for its future. The Knights of Favonius have always been conducting alchemy research, and they've been looking for a way so to showcase their results. Lisa came up with the idea to open a potion shop. The people of Mondstadt can learn more about alchemy, and the Knights can better understand their needs. Everybody oh, okay. wins. Okay. 
That sounds super exciting. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Especially since travelers will get to run the potion shop during this event. Oh? And what'll that look like? In the Alchemical Ascension event, travelers okay. will need to cultivate herbs, brew potions, and sell their oh. products to increase the shop's revenue and okay. expand their business. So, so the mating our own said. potions. Oh, I love that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Or our own travelers alchemical, who the revenue and run uh, well, the shop smoothly the will be able to earn various rewards. These include Primo Gems and Dialogues of Desert, desert, desert Sages. Dialogues of Desert Sages. Nice. <laughs> star Travelers can also look forward to meeting familiar companions at the shop. <laughs> Travelers can scale their business even faster <laughs> if they fulfill these special customers' requirements. Oh, hmm. sounds pretty neat. Yeah. <laughs> I'm hyped. That sounds yeah. great. <laughs> Me too. That's all like I have to announce selling... about this event. What? What's the next bit of news? Edith? Okay. I feel like we don't even need to introduce don't this even need one. To introduce this Everyone one. can understand that our upcoming content is about cats. <sighs> uh, yeah. It's like I hey, cats. <laughs> <Your aura? laughs> Julie's already gotten in the character. Yeah. Hey, wait, wait a second. Sucrose also has animal ears, right? Hmm. Yeah. She doesn't have a tail, yeah. though. Yeah, I mean... Wow. So Sucrose isn't part cat? No comment. Wait, really? No comment. <laughs> Look at her eyes. <laughs> We've completely gone off topic. Let's get back to introducing the most important Lee, event, Ellen, the Feline Fortress, Fortress Fertacy. The Traveler and Paimon have encountered all sorts of strange creatures during their journey through Tavad. But this time, yep. they've decided it's to take some time to visit the familiar the cat's cat's tail. Tail. Oh, oh, That makes sense, mm -hmm. since they've been on the road for so long. There's no better way to relieve your fatigue than spending time with some cuddly cats. I mean, yeah. some people are more, uh, more well, dog <laughs> lovers. <laughs> to be precise, not this event sorry. doesn't actually take place Especially at the cat's tail. A kind-hearted person recently prepared a new space for the cats to That's play right. to their heart's content. Wait, Travelers so simply need like to set up fluffy feline homes for the cats, satisfy specific for, target requirements, and well, provide like a, the cats with their favorite food. Serenity and only then will Travelers be able to play with their furry friends at the throne of Meower. That's yeah, more for the cats, with cats can be a little tricky. Uh, oh. They'll get angry well, no. if you do something that makes them uncomfortable. Just do your best. Okay, so how to have become good pet friends with your cat. all of the cats? They'll be able to Rating make a mode, special seems. friend. Yep. And it seems like you're already a very good friend to the cats. Hey, you know what all this <laughs> cat talk reminds me of? Hmm? Card games. <laughs> In Tabat, they're pretty closely associated, yeah. right? I yeah, can tra definitely wait, see wait. travelers returning to the cat's tail to play some genius invocation <laughs> TCG after playing with cats. Play with the cats. Charlotte, Rara, play some cards. Electro, Cecil, H. Play some cards. cards. Suddenly, I feel like there's not enough hours in the day. Yeah, <laughs> you you there's not trouble, enough then. hours in the day. Version 4.5 is adding even more new cards, events, and challenges to Genius Invocation TCG for all travelers. Aside from playing with Great. cats and engaging in card Rolling games, crossfire. the developers also prepared some challenges that will give travelers the opportunity What's to this? show up their skills. Ooh. In version 4.5, travelers cards? will meet two guard members in Fontaine. Fontaine. One okay. of them is a genius inventor, who rejected an invitation from the Fontaine Research <laughs> Institute rejected? three times. Three times oh, wow. from the Fontaine sure Research Institute? Like there are a lot of geniuses in Fontaine. Why? I wonder if that place has so many cool inventions. I mean, maybe he wanted to this work alone. This genius inventor will lend the traveler a remote cannon that he invented to take down a fearsome down hilly churl rogue. Show rogue. Uh, I meant that the cannon will be used to take down slimes. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Oh. <laughs> Oh, kind of is that, is that... marbles that we would play with when we were younger. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What? Totally. So, in this event, <laughs> travelers this? will remotely operate a turret to fire elemental shells this is at a turret, but you have to work slimes. on Try to elemental as reaction. Many slimes as you can by triggering elemental reactions. Reminds me of that game that we had to the more rewards do. that you can obtain. Ooh. Yes, give me <laughs> special equipment will also <laughs> appear on the field. We are spamming. Using them we are spamming you even more points. <laughs> Sweet. Okay, our next event involves oh. a mysterious concoction called the Phase Potion. Oh, that's phase something that Jami developed, right? The Great Phase if Reaction I Debate. He's a researcher from the Amorta Doshan. the traveler participate Jami. in a bunch of experiments Jami. to help him with his thesis? Yep. Oh. He's made some improvements oh. since then, and he's waiting for someone to test them Maybe I wasn't there. Hmm. In happened. previous challenges, you so had is that to a combat event? Effect. 
time, travelers will automatically He's enter like time dilation mode when you enter the challenge arena. Oh. You can even take pictures when this mode is active. Neat. Mm -hmm. You can take pictures? Time will resume when you move or use any type of skill. You'll enter time dilation mode again once you stop moving or using your skills. Oh. Mm -hmm. It'll be yep. great for time will stop screenshots. as long as you don't move after unleashing a skill. It's pretty sweet, right? <laughs> I'm sure that travelers will be able to take tons of cool pictures of their characters. Wow. Yeah, absolutely. Travelers will also need to focus on accumulating phase force during combat. Once you have enough of it, you'll be given an advantage that will help you complete the challenge. Awesome. Ooh. Also, the oh. Leyline Overflow event will be returning Force. in version 4.5, so right. don't miss out, you guys. Yeah. Well, we've yeah, finished Primal gems. all the events in version 4.5. Uh, next Aerials. up, we have... Well, wait a second. We've oh. just announced a lot of information, don't you think? Yeah. That's true. Uh, Let's take a short break it's and not enough. The last reduction code before we continue. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. Then we'll see everyone, everyone on, on the flip, flip side. side. See ya yeah. soon. Bye-bye. So, um, the chat, the chat, uh, event, chat pivoting event, um, we have the potion selling events that is more tailored to, uh, characters showing up that we haven't seen in so long. That is going to happen in Mondstadt. We have, um, what else? The combat event with the <laughs> sick screenshots we can get um what else what we had the wait we have the ley line of a flow but that's common i think that there's a lot of events but nothing major and that's okay that's totally fine that means i can focus on something else <laughs> and well time being Welcome back. In addition to the new events in version 4.5, the developers uh -huh. also plan to fuse system optimizations. Okay, system optimizations. Yeah. Let's see, what After do we have After version 4.5, travelers will be able to view a character's Ooh, talent upgrade materials on the character talent interface menu. Hopefully, this helps everyone understand what materials they need in order to improve a character's skills. Oh. Remember the new training guide Great. that we mentioned earlier? That's also a new feature that's coming to yeah. version 4.5. Travelers who are adventure rank 12 or higher and have completed the quest, Welcome to the Adventurer's Guild, will be able to refer to this guide what? by accessing the Paimon menu or pause menu. This guide will provide I mean, enhancement it... goals and suggestions. Do we trust worthy levels, though? Levels, weapons, um, artifacts, and talents of your characters. Is it good enough in order to, to help everyone focus on account. what is Hopefully, this supposed guide will to be, be helpful leveled, to travelers who just up. started their journey into oh. that? Yep, this guide was designed as a helpful I mean, resource Maybe it's for based on average. Relatively new to no. that. Rating. There's so much to discover Everyone using impact. I'm sure the travelers will eventually weapons. figure out the best system for them. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> Exploring all those possibilities is part of the fun. Totally. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so far, we've just been covering the in-game content. Is that in nature discovery tour? To share. During version 4.5, Genshin Impact will be teaming up with the Genshin Discovery Impact's Channel the to launch Discovery benefit events that raise awareness Vision. about environmental Discovery Channel. Collaboration. Characters will serve as nice. ambassadors for specific natural landscapes. <laughs> we have that Chave. Is that Chave outfit out though? Wow. That is such a cool I want, I want that. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> During version 4.5, yeah. travelers can also look forward to the release oh, of the Chinuvel album, Jadeite Jadeite Relics. Relics. The album will be comprised of two, two discs, discs, which feature over 50 right. tracks by the Hoyo nice. mix. 50 tracks. It will contain Ooh, music tracks. from version 4.4. Mm -hmm. It even includes the music featured in the Lantern Rite Festival and Shen Yun's Story Shen Quest. Rite Festival <laughs> and Shen Yun's so Story cool. Quest. Wait. Oh, cool. <laughs> All right. Seems like we've delivered all of the information. Wait, does that mean that we've come to the end of the special program? Yeah. Oh, already? Oh, they're not going yeah, to, so to, to tease something it's about really Madeline. Did. <laughs> okay, but is anyone else super excited for the cat cafe? Yes. Oh, uh, yes. yes. Obviously. Yes, absolutely. Like, immediately. Cats. 100%. 110%. I'm also really excited uh -huh. for everyone to meet Chiori. Woo! I mean, like, they met her, yeah. but absolutely. I want them uh, to, like, meet her. Like, get to know her. Yes. See her cool sword. Scissor attack. Cool sword scissor so cool. attack. Yes. Right. Yeah. I mean, I'm a little biased, but you know. I mean, and I think that's fair. You are. <laughs> fair. Yes, very fair. Thank you, thank you. I will so. probably 
end up spending a lot of time on the rolling crossfire rolling event crossfire event uh, yeah me too <laughs> me too yes, that me too i will destroy, we'll destroy those slimes destroy the slimes destroy the slimes I roll with it then huh <laughs> i had to i had to <laughs> <laughs> that's so good bye everyone so good. <laughs> bye everyone thanks for coming and guys yeah. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> see you bye. later see you in game <laughs> Today I'm hosting with um going to go to specific part of special program. So I think what is uh interesting uh there obviously look at that that is the ocean rating also seems alcohol all of it. I wonder if it could also be used to turn water into wine? The alchemy reaction. A strength enhancing potion could make it so that Pinewood could take down an abyss mage all on her own. How are we supposed to make a potion like that? From Imagine Pinewood gets stronger pain. by it's having like a... It was never there. In this in my arsenal, I bet I could deliver 200 orders in a single day. Excuse okay, so me. Coming through. Coming through. Jerry, your, your shipment's here. Need a bit of letting out yeah. around the middle. No, just ran into a bit of trouble. <laughs> you see the wound guard. <laughs> it's up to me to decide who I want to be. Of course, my own fury. No one can tell me what to do. seamstress. I, I like that she's dual wielding. So cool. Let's go, Tomato. Delicate as silk. I like that combination. Next customer, the speed is on. Okay. can switch. All the characters so quickly. Is Siori here? I'd like to return That's my crazy. outfit. What kind of rag are you trying to sell us, huh? You didn't get bought so, up yeah. by competitors. Blade weaving betwixt brocade. So there's also um look. So of course her her gameplay, where she plays. Um, she, she, she is cool, but I don't know if I'll be pulling on her or not. It all depends on, um, yeah, what the reviews say about her. Then we'll see. To me, personally, I don't know if I'll be, if I'll be pulling. Um, yeah. And she, she is cool, don't get me wrong, but, um, I want to make sure that I'm using my humor gems, my point fates carefully. Also, um, we have new story quests. For the new story quests, cool. So this will have, I mean, give us a way to um, understand more about how story functions. I mean, what is her mindset? And also, Chirara will be a part of story quests. Also, yeah, that. Hang out. Hang out with Lynette. I would have liked if it was a story quest, but... And Lynette in the hangout. It's amazing. I mean, we had Lini as story quest. We had Fermine in an event quest with um, Belty's Adventure. So oh, yeah, complete the trio, siblings, siblings trio. Yeah, we had to get Lynette with something, and they decided to give her a hangout of that. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. Um, so yeah, Aratachito is making a comeback in dishes. We have her new weapon, the Raku Mystery. Um, I'd like to know the lore. Specific weapon. See, something in specific. Also, that is uh, really astonishing. Nuvolite making a comeback. <laughs> it's making a comeback so quickly. I did not even think about that for a second. How did they come back so quickly? I mean, that's great for people who didn't had the chance, who didn't have the chance to pull for him uh, during the. Alcon Mountain Alcon quest. Um but yeah, um if you don't 
if if you don't have him yet, I'll I'll, I'll suppose it's not a not a bad bargain to find pool for him if you can because he he is pretty strong, pretty strong. And Kazuya, yeah, these two banners here, amazing banner. Kazuya is a uh, is a main staple in a lot of teams. Evil let is the <laughs> Hydro Dragon Sovereign, so who wouldn't want to pull for him? Also, that is huge. This one here is huge. Why is it huge? Because this is the first time ever that we have some sort of pity for characters, five star characters, which is insane. Um, maybe. Maybe in the future we will also have um, a T for four star characters as well that we don't didn't have. Uh, I hope at least that we we will uh, get this. But yeah, it seems like the first six five star characters that we have: Yula, Obedo, Boot, Lee, and Mona, obviously. Um, if I had to take guess as to what I would like to to first, I don't know. It's between Lee, Lula, and Albedo. I don't have these three, so yeah. This we'll see. As for the weapon banners, five five star weapons. Well, um, these three. I mean, I yeah, I don't think I have this one. This I, I, I don't know. I, I do. I mean, <laughs> anyways, but these two specifically, yeah, I don't have. Oh, and wait, wait. So this one I don't have. This one I don't have. Oh, well, and no, wait. This one, this one, one, this one, and this one. The others I do have, but this is amazing. This is the first time that uh, <laughs> for universe actually not about the player base uh, who don't have all the characters and are not whales and are not spending um, <laughs> money, <laughs> tons of money in order to have the characters that they want to have. So that is a huge improvement, and I hope that they continue to. We do this more in the future. So, Chronicle Wish now available. Is it available now, like today, or is it going to be available? Maybe in, ver in version 4.0. It's also, um, let's have a look. Okay, so we have that. Um, here. So, I want to read. To read this, um, Alchemical Ascension. Boots of Avonius are currently coming up with long term plans to promote the achievements of alchemy. Yeah, it's a free way to get to know Albedo and Sutros and Tais, and I guess Lisa as well, more. And oh, okay, so the person in charge, Lisa, seems to have a good idea and has invited you and Paimon, the sister. So we have the exalted earth. Oh, exalted earth. Sorry, exalted earth. So I think these are the refinements for this pole arm here. Dialogues of the desert sages. This one is cool. With the two um, intertwined snakes. Oh. I, I I want to know the lore about this weapon specifically. Um, so, we get to see more characters. So we have to cultivate, to cultivate plants or herbs. Teams. Yeah, I see. Yes. Doing great. And there was also something, I mean, not similar, but in the same vein. 
uh, with in Hontai Star Rail with um the uh, little um creations from uh, Ron May and it was so cute and I think they were trying to get in that same vein at least I think obviously um revenue so we have a revenue system financial report so it's in cycles so yeah you have to cultivate so that you can trade or sell your products to people so that you can continue to have profits cycles it seems yeah this is the automatical extension Going to, we're going to see many characters such as Beto and Yula in there. Guests here. So this is uh, related to chats. <laughs> um, for dog lovers, I don't know. I don't know if you like this, but cat lovers, a eh? that's so great. Gross. Uh, Felon Fortress Birdsey. Nice pun, by the way. Uh. <laughs> You'll get still you will get um Rimmer Gem, Ranches Experience, Found Materials and more. Not too bad. Let's see. Your recent travels have seen you and Paimon encounter all manner of strange creatures. Yeah, that we did. But in light of various factors, I would still like to have some fun with cats. As such, you intend to return to Mondstadt, drop by the Catsdale. Yeah, so we're going back to Chatsdale for that event specifically. And I think, yeah, it was uh, the furnishing system. So here we have some um, meters for durability, aesthetics, have ornaments, seats, cabinets. So that is a way to make your chat love you more. Feed the chat. You can feed them. That reminds me in uh, Chaoying Village when we had to give um, a morsel of uh, fish or tuna, or tuna to, to their cats or for it to move over to give us a chest. And here you can pet the cat or cats. And we have uh, a meter as well. We have trusted, cherished, and inseparable. Here, in this part here. Yes? Yeah. Apparently, it did not work well. And, uh. Have to know when to give him some love, I suppose. And when he has enough love, well, he goes away. Beautiful session. Also, new trading uh, trading card games. I said, <laughs> yeah, uh, new cards have been um, put into the TTG um, game. Gerara, Nouvellet, Charlotte, and Leolatris is in Mage. So that's great. I'm not a, I'm not a, a huge TTG player because um, well, I mean. I try to play, but not for everyone. I suppose. even if it's I I like watching it. I I think I'm, I'm I like more watching it on on a whole and playing it. To be honest, um. Also, yeah, like that. <laughs> like that said, the rolling crossfire event. I think everyone is going to enjoy. Uh, the genius inventor of the gods has created a new kind of remote cannon in order to test its combat effectiveness. They are looking for professionals to participate in firing experiments. I'll say no more. Um, <laughs> everyone is going to spam the, the cannon, the remote cannon, to destroy as many limes as possible. Yeah. I think the the fun fact is that the, this is going to be a 
a huge way for beginners in Genshin Impact to understand elemental reactions. And yeah, it's going to be so, fun so funny. I can't wait to play this event when it drops. Sure. Um, but yeah, it seems like the, this guy, I don't know. Wait, wait, let me, let me have a look. Um, so yeah, um, <laughs> this guy, uh, the genius inventor, has been refusing or rejecting the Fontaine Research Institute invitation three times. <laughs> this is because I think he wants to work alone and does not need anyone else to impede his progress as an inventor. I can understand that. But yeah, let's look at this. So, yeah, as you see, you need to understand elemental reactions in order to play this game. No, it's not complicated. You need to understand how that works. Oh, oh, but when you hit, wait, wait, let me, let me pause. So there was something here. Yeah, here, this specifically. When you hit that, it makes, um, well, it may, lets you spam, <laughs> lets you spam for a certain duration. But it also lets you, um, well, negate all, all um, elemental reactions so that you can hit literally every slime, no matter the, the elemental type they are. So, yeah, that's awesome. And, uh, yeah, I was spamming, to be honest. Here's in shell. Um, what else do we have? So yeah, this one here, the great phase, phase reaction state. I don't think I, I was playing when this event came out. At least I don't have any recollection of that. But let's see. Uh, Dami, the Murta researcher who earlier developed marvelous phase potion, has once again encountered trouble. As such, he has adopted more efficient enhancement measures and is waiting for the right person to help verify his work. So, yeah, that's in this event you can actually get some screenshots while, while fighting. Here, see? Yeah, I think this event will. Help everyone with getting some sick screenshots. I think, I'll, yeah, I'll try my hand at screenshotting some amazing um bolts or skills. Yeah, that's going to be amazing. Um, <laughs> so, um, yeah, I think that, um, great base, um, ocean reaction debate is going to be interesting to see how there are some amazing screenshots and capture, yeah, amazing combos and such. Let's see. But yeah, next up, let me have a look. Oh yeah, that. So, we have a general optimization system. 
So as they said here, that's that. Okay. So after version 4.5, travelers will be able to view characters talent of materials on the character talent interfa interface menu. Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. So you don't need now to click, click on this specific uh, pointers. Just, just have to uh, click here, and then just need to see what is required. Oh yeah, that's that I guess is a is a good upgrade. Yeah. Okay. Then they talked about yes, this. Uh, remember the training guide that we mentioned earlier. Also, a new new feature that's coming to version four point five. Current maximum level. So, well, when it comes to world level, they will say if your Party character power is sufficient, weak, or medium average. They'll try to say try level try leveling it up. Yeah, so you have to enhance here. Have character level level leveled. Well, artifacts and character talents. Well, adventure rank 12 higher and left. Press welcome to build. Refer to this guy by time on menu. Pause menu. Tools and suggestions. On the levels weapons. Yeah. I have to pause as well. Let's see. Um. I don't know. I don't know about, about this one. For beginners, for beginners and for casual players, I suppose. Yeah, this is going to be great. It will help us tremendously in uh, figuring out what is the best way to get some more power. This. Radiant talents is the top priority. So it seems like this is due, I mean, is calculated based on the rates of everyone playing. What is the, what are the talents that people, or travelers like to upgrade first? What are the weapons that are recommended for the specific character that people have used a lot? Recommended artifact sets, artifact set for the specific character. Of course, leveling leveling that character. Yeah. Also, um, see that each your discovery tour. So, Genshin Impact and the Discovery Channel with a collaboration, and. I think we'll have some news regarding that version 4.5 hits, or we may see that on the lab website. And I'd like to know, I mean, I'm sure it's going to be the same with uh, what we had John Lee. Um, yeah, they're not going to give us this outfit. Nice outfit for Kave. I don't know why they don't want to give us some more outfits. Um, and point have the Jedi Dreadlands. Piece of the Chenuvel OST album. So they say it will contain music version 4.4. Even includes a music featured in 
Lantern Rite Festival, and John Yoon's. That's awesome. But yeah. Um, that has been the special program for version 4.5 in a nutshell. Uh, it's quite short, of course. I, of course, I rambled a lot um, during the special program, but uh, yeah. It's, as I said before, it's on the, it's the chill side. It's not anything crazy. Um, lots of, um, lots of, um, events we're going to tackle. Uh, mini, mini events, games, um, a new story quest, hangout, um, That is going to be amazing. Siori, learn more about her. Chihuahua's going to be there. Going to have to work on alchemy. Sell it to the highest bidder, I suppose. But uh, yeah. Like Zach said, um, I'm so excited for the, um, what, what's, what's, The called yeah the rolling crossfire. Um, I'm so excited for the rolling crossfire. Uh, I'm so excited as well. Uh, Sherry's uh, story quest, as well as uh, Lynette's hangout. So, and of course, the yeah, ultimate. Yeah. What are you guys thinking about this uh, 4.5 special program? Have any thoughts regarding this? Um, I mean, it's the right amount of um, events and games. So, match. Oh. Not overbearing. It's not um, not going to put us in the ground. It's on the chill side, but at the same time, it's it's bright. It's bright to be on the chill side. What we had um, earlier with Ancient Rite Festival, Discovery of Chinchill, which I'm still going to continue today. 